today I'm finally filming the house tour video. So I've been meaning to do this for like the past month since we moved in, but I wanted everything to look perfect, spick and span, have everything clean and put away, and then I realized that's not happening. You know, I try to clean and then I have a four and a half almost, almost five year old. So every time I clean, mess and destruction. Uh, that's why I'm almost five year old. <laughs> happens shortly afterwards. So I just gotta do a whatever is what it is house tour video, lived in house. So yeah, I'm just gonna get to it and show you guys everything. Iris always wants to do something too, so she wants me to hurry up with this video so we can go out and do something fun. But I've been wanting to show you guys our new house for a while. Um, we really like it. We're close to a really fun park that we can walk to. We'll probably do that in a little bit here. But yeah, everything is very new, updated, and modern. Like uh, We're the first people to ever live in this house. This is new construction. You might even hear construction going on right now because they're building a house next door to us. Actually, I guess I'll start by turning around. This is the entryway here. And then you turn and there's stairs that go up to the bedrooms up there. Or we turn around this way and this is the main level. Here there's a door down to the basement. The basement is still unfinished. We can do whatever we want with it. And then we have a bathroom here on the main level. There's a toilet, just a small little bathroom here. And we can turn, there's the living room. Lots of closet space in this house. So there's a closet right here. Here is our living room. I put the gray couch that was in our family room here. It's a little big for the room, but whatever. I think it works, but the color looks really nice with all the colors in this house. And then Iris kind of turned these shelves into a little dollhouse or something, shadow box. She always puts her toys there. So I'm still in the process of getting blinds and all that jazz. You know, the houses are really close together here, but um, the convenience and the updatedness is worth it. I really like it and it doesn't bother me too much. We'll put shades and then I won't even notice. So there is a fireplace over here that's working. Actually, I should, I'll turn it on for you guys so that you can see. Yeah, so here's our fireplace, which will be really fun in the winter. Then I have my little sideboard over this way. I said I haven't hung up any pictures yet. I was thinking that would look nice above there. Back here, we just have a mudroom area, the dog beds there along with the mop closet where all of our shoes and coats are. And then here is the garage. Uh, my dad's using the car right now, but Good sized garage. I think it's a two car garage. I still have some stuff in the garage that I need to put away. So these are all the shoes and coats. Okay, thought we should show them all that stuff? These are my, my new sneakers, but they don't fit me anymore. <laughs> these are just my baby sneakers. So then we turn around from the living room and we have the kitchen. Again, I really like the color scheme in this house, which is part of the reason I picked it out. And we, the house came with brand new appliances, brand new fridge, brand new stove, brand new dishwasher down here, all Whirlpool appliances. So turn, turn, turn so you guys can see a little better. Um, then we have a dining area in the corner here with my black table, chandelier. Oh, I gotta find a, a good way to stand so that the lighting adjusts. Here we'll be able to put a deck on someday. Obviously haven't done that yet. They have a special lock on there so you can't open it until a deck is attached. There you go, our little dining nook. So then I'll turn around to show you guys that we have a big walk-in pantry fill up with food eventually. I'm also storing some random things in here for now, setting paintings and whatnot. There's our canned goods, y'all. Okay, so now let's go upstairs and I'm gonna show you guys all of the bedrooms. Do you wanna show? 
You wanna show all your rooms? Rooms, yes, Iris has two rooms. That was rooms, plural. I really like this little nook here, so I just wanna show their little standing thing. Oh, this house has a lot of great natural light, which is really, really good for filming. So this is the upstairs, okay, okay, okay. Iris really wants to show off her rooms, plural. Yep, so this house has like Jack and Jill bedrooms okay. and they're kind of small. Okay, now we'll go back to Oh, right, hang on, hang on, hang on. I gotta explain some stuff, kid. So we just put Iris's dresser and toys in this room, so she'll play in there. There you can see they're building a house next to us. All these new houses in this area are tall and skinny and they pack them all pretty close together because it's a pretty high sought after area because it's a really good school district. Okay, so there's a closet over here which I just use for storage and this is the Jack and Jill so it connects to a bathroom. And this is my bathroom. This is Iris's bathroom. How many kids do you think have their own bathroom? Five. Five in the whole world? <laughs> so this is Iris's bathtub over here. I don't have a curtain up yet. We'll have to buy you a fun curtain for in here. This is the floor pattern for you guys can see. Toilet for going potty in. Yep. Okay, I'm just trying to back up here so you can see Iris's sink. So this is the sink. I really love the colors again. Lights up there, big mirror. Then we turn here, the Jack and Jill, and we get to Iris's bedroom. Yeah, this is my bedroom, and Aphrodite is sleeping on my bed. Yeah, Aphrodite's sleeping on Iris's bed. So the, he's, these are the curtains we put up the other day. Do you like your bedroom, Iris? Yeah. Cool. So she has a chair over here, and then ev pretty much every room has a big closet like this. I still need to buy more hangers to hang up Iris's clothes in here. So sometimes Aphrodite crawls up in my bed at night, and I like that. Yeah. She just snuggles with me, and I'm gonna show you my stuffed animals now. This little guy. That's cute. And I got this little guy. What's his name? Stitch. Yup. And I don't know what her name is. I don't know either. I haven't seen that movie. Grandpa gave those to you for one Christmas. Both of them? Mm-hmm. Actually, her dresser could maybe fit in this corner here. I wonder if we should do that. Okay, here's Pikachu. Very cool. And his tulip connected to his head. Yup. So you can put your hand and he can fit. All right, now for the rest of the upstairs. So then out of Iris's room, in the middle of the upstairs, we have a laundry utility room. So kind of all the new houses that we were looking at, they do laundry rooms upstairs now, which I thought that was kind of interesting, but it is super, super convenient. So here's just another Hi, view guys. of the upstairs now hallway. I'm show you all my dolls. <laughs> they, they saw all your dolls already. Oh, they didn't see these ones? They have to see all these ones. Oh, okay. There you guys go. Those are the rest of the dolls. Yep. So this is my pony that lights up in the cool colors. Yep. You just press this little Q mark. Okay, so now for the master bedroom. This is my room. My bedspread and curtains are temporary. I plan to decorate soon. So here's my bed. Just trying to get different angles to show you guys. So the master bedroom is really big. I like the ceilings in here too, the shape of the ceiling. So here we go, Iris is, I don't know what she's doing, she's rubbing her butt on my bed or something. <laughs> Throwing stuff around. I'm looking for Simon. Oh, you're looking for Simon, okay. So then we can turn around, These are, this is the other wall other angle of the master bedroom. My bedroom furniture I think looks great in here though. Like this color looks great against the walls. I just kinda want to add more detail and decorate and whatnot. Okay, so now I'll show you guys the master bathroom. So again, we have the, the same color for the sinks here. You can see a giant mirror. So let me turn around. I have a big glass shower, which is absolutely wonderful. And then a bathtub over here. And I love this white tile. I think it's so elegant looking. 
And there's a window up there that changes the lighting. So that shower, and then you keep going and here's the toilet room. It's just a, a separated room by itself. And then my closet is in the master bathroom also, which I haven't finished putting everything away, but I have a big walk-in closet that I can put all my stuff in. Oh my gosh, there's Simon, he just came out of my closet. <laughs> I guess Simon got locked in my closet. So I guess I can show you guys a little bit of the basement. Again, it's not finished, so there's not much to it. I probably will finish it off someday and turn it into like a family room or maybe put an office down there or something. But once this is finished, it adds quite a bit of square footage onto the house. Oh, the lighting's kind of dark. So this is it. I'm just kind of using it for storage right now. Litter box is over there in the corner. Oh, there you go. Yeah, we can turn the lights on down here. Then all the utility stuff. But yeah, once this is finished, you can see it like will add on a lot to this house. So we just got sod the other day, which I can show you guys. We've been tying the dogs up with rope. Um, eventually I wanna put a fence so that I could put a trampoline back here and just be able to let the dogs run. But it's actually a good sized backyard. Iris has been playing with the Halloween decorations. She found them down here, which I'm so glad she turned on all the Halloween decorations, by the way. That was wonderful coming down to the basement by myself at night and all of a sudden have a skeleton scream at me. Do you like your new house? Yeah. You love it here? Good. Well guys, this is my bachelorette pad. We've been really liking it here. We're close to a lot of fun stuff. There's a lot of kids close by too, which is awesome. Are you spacing out? What happened? Did you check out? Did you check out for the day? What's going on here? <laughs> But yeah, I think we're gonna have a lot of fun living here. I definitely really appreciate the convenience. It's so much easier to clean than so, my last place. Bye guys. Yes, I am ra I am wrapping it up. Just a second here. Um, yeah, obviously it's never gonna be perfect because this house is lived in, but I mean, I can clean this whole main level here in like 30 minutes, which is awesome. It doesn't take all day like the last place I was living. Blah, 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 blah. Alright guys, I am going to wrap things up. Thank you guys so much for watching this much anticipated new house tour. We're gonna have a lot of fun, right? Yep. Yep, we're gonna have a lot so, of fun. Bye guys. Bye guys. Bye. Love you.